What's up YouTube, my name is Paladin and thank you guys for stopping into a brand new YouTube video. Um, today, well actually today marks, it's been about a week since I recorded a video. I actually didn't, I did not even record a Mute All podcast that I normally do each and every week. Uh, I took a week off between work and trying to come up with, um, not, not coming up with brand new content, but uh, putting together, piecing together this brand new content for you guys. It's taken a toll on me a little bit, so I kind of stepped back from making any videos last week and just focused on getting everything organized and ready for you guys for the future. So today we're going to be doing our second installment in the Mobilitics review. If you guys didn't watch the first episode, basically, instead of me tracking every single game that I'm playing this season in rank, I'm just going to track every 50 games and we're going to do a Mobilitics review uh, to see how I compare and see where I'm at, what I'm doing well, what I'm doing bad at, strengths and weaknesses probably a better way to say it. Like I said before in the other video, this video was not sponsored by Mobilitics at all. I just like using the app, so we'll, we'll get right into it here. Currently, I believe last episode we were gold four, or right now we're gold two, 25 LP. Um, I haven't played, I haven't played a game in, I wanna say two days. I've been playing, was it two days? And it's actually been close to a week. I actually haven't played on this account. I've been playing on my Smurf, my jungle Smurf and my support Smurf, kind of having fun climbing on there. I didn't want to play a game until we actually got to this video. So that's why I haven't played. So you can see I ended, eh, not the greatest, kind of win trading, going one win, losing one, one win. Not very fun. So we're gonna go, actually I didn't even mean to have play there. We'll go here and break down kind of what we're doing, how we're playing right now. So, I said Plat 3 last year. No, oh, yeah, Plat 3 last year as we've gone over this. Uh, right now sitting at Gold 2 ELO, just across the board. 51 and 50, 50% 50 win rate, not very good. Um, I'm actually a little disappointed in myself. The biggest, the biggest problem as to why um, the first, through the first 50 games, I played a lot of Gangplank. Actually, I don't think I played a Gangplank game since the, that Mobilitics video. I play a lot of Gangplank, and although I, I played it very well, I wasn't winning a lot. So I stopped playing Gangplank, and I focused on primarily my three my three other champions, which was Yorick, Urgot, and Nar at that time. Then Swain came out, and I played I played a lot of Swain on, my, um, on one of my Smurfs, and I was like, okay, I kind of have an idea of how I want to play Swain how he's going to be played he wasn't he's not very viable top lane at the moment so i was like ah, i'm like i'm gonna do it i'm gonna be the first person i'm gonna bring swain to the meta win a lot of games because people don't know how to play against him well i was wrong <laughs> i actually did not win a single swain game since he's been reworked i won one swain game I, I think i went one and one prior to him being uh reworked and then i literally lost five straight games <laughs> like i did not it did not bow well for me at all so that's where i, I lost my i was at about like a 53 54 win rate actually i think it was 54 win rate and i dropped and now that, that that's one of the biggest reasons losing a lot of games I, like i said i am i play yorick mainly and i i play i play him very very no it's not gonna show me any more games I play him very, uh, very safe unless I'm in a lane where I'm playing against something like uh, Aurelia or Fiora or Garen or something where I can, or Gnosis where I can kind of play a little more aggressive and whoop on him. But gold two, like I said, we, we have climbed. Uh, let's see if I can check the tier list here. So right, right around here, I believe is when we did the first Mobilitics video. And then we've kind of, like I said, I haven't really played much here. I played about a week, so that's kind of why we've plateaued. So I'm hoping that this Mobilitic, we can figure out a little bit of what I should be doing more of. I'm going to probably go off, off of a limb and say I'm going to need to play more aggressive, but we'll see what it says. All right. So now that we're here in the app, as you can see, still the same win rate, obviously. Uh, let's see if it... So this is pretty... Yeah, this is... I mean, this is very similar to what it was last, last time. My consistency went down a lot. Which was, which was actually something that I I did pretty well. You have many losses that you've could have been that could have been comebacks, but you weren't quite able to pull it together with 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 the use of your of our advice. You can learn what we know. Yeah, let's see. So, how to improve? Staying composed is one of the most important things you can do when you win games. In fact, it's important that we write a whole blog post about how to stay composed. So they actually have a, okay. So they have a blog. Shout out to XL here. I follow him. We both live in Ohio. I think. He, move to Cali or something like that but I'll read read that in my spare time here so it looks like laning phase I do very well 
uh, performance across the board when it comes to kills, assists. That's that's what that is one of the things with York is I don't necessarily get a lot of kills. You see here, I'm, I average two, three, and three a game, or three, two, and yeah, three, two, and three a game. I don't get a lot of kills. I don't die a lot. I mainly sit in the side lane and farm. I get about eight CS per minute, which is in which is decent uh, for 33 games. Uh, but a lot of the time, you'll, you'll see here, I don't have a lot of kill participation. I really don't. And it's, um, except like games like this where I go off. A lot of it is, I'm putting myself in a lane where I know I play better as a split pusher. I knock down first turret, I herald, and I just keep pushing. And then there comes a point in the game where I, I reach a crossroads where I need to make a decision on if I need to group or if I need to keep split pushing. And I would say majority of the time I make the wrong decision. So let, let's say there's a situation where I should be splitting more and I go in group and I lose my lead and we lose the game that way. Or I've noticed I'll keep split pushing and we're at a time where I should use my TP to come in and help and my team loses a team, a very crucial team fight and we lose Baron uh, and then transitions into them being tilted because they didn't TP and then we lose. So that's something I do need to work on. I think that really fits into to the consistency there. Check out toughness. I believe this is the... It's very hard to kill you. Yeah, I, I average under one death. Uh, enemy team can't even seem to capitalize on your deaths. If you're going to die, you might as well die when there's when nothing can be made out of it. Yeah, um, I tend to stay alive pretty well in 2v1 situations under turret. And also, I try to push myself into a place where if I die, they're not going to get anything off of it. It's whether I push them in too far, my team can capitalize and get grab something else. Uh, let's see, aggression. Kill participation, that's definitely the biggest thing. You might be related to Jankos because you're almost... You're, you're almost the you're almost the king of first blood you're able to take first blood as well as first turret often and in turn you're securing yourself yeah so individually i'm playing well so i'm able to i'm able to crush my lane opponent normally get first blood and first turret but then i don't transition that into map domination which is where my kill participation is so small yeah that makes sense and it's it, and it's not like I'm getting a shit ton of kills. Like I may get first blood and then I won't get another kill until I get the turret. But my kill participation is not very good. Kills at 15 minutes and assists at 15 minutes. I'm one and a half kills a game. I'm one and a half kills at 15 minutes and not even an assist a minute. I mean at, at 15 minutes, which is pretty bad. I mean it, it, with York, it just I'm not gonna get a lot of kill participation. But I should try to I should look to group a little bit more when I'm playing him. Let's see what else here. Let's see if this has anything to say about the games that I have played. Despite having high gold income, this game your damage to champions was very low. Well, damage per minute, that's 700 damage per minute. It's not good. Gold per minute's 417, that's pretty good. CS, a little bit low. To me, what, the, what it looks like, that my biggest issue is just, so when you look at this, all right, as you can see here, I mean, out of the champions that I've been playing mostly, you got York, I haven't touched Gangplank, Urgot, Nar, we won't talk about Swain, uh, Mundo, and Scion. So I started recently playing Scion again. Love it, love it. He is a, uh, he is my, um, my pure counter to Jax because Jax counters Urgot, or not Jax, yeah, Jax counters Urgot and Jax counters Yorick. So if someone first picks Jax, uh, I could just pick Scion into it and crush him. Um, but those, these are really the only, the only champions that I've been playing. Okay, I guess down here for whatever reason okay so we're down there so i think i played i think i played a few other Jax games top lane that's it that's it i think it's really just been york york ergot nar and then cyan and mundo recently so for the for these next 50 games i'm gonna focus more on trying to trying to get a little more aggressive um as well as just playing more consistent because it, it my, my consistency was something that i know last time was very very high and i was basically winning my lane getting first blood almost every single game and it doesn't seem like i'm doing that as much now so i think i need to focus on doing that let's see where i compare to um so that, that's just compared to gold so plat overall i'm playing basically like a diamond level player i just i need to increase my aggression i'll work on that uh thank you guys for watching this video like i said before if you guys haven't checked out this mobilytics app i would go check it out it's very very helpful it breaks down all right, and that's gonna wrap up this video. Um, the big summary here, we need to play more aggressive and stop playing champions like Swain and Gangplank. Um, that's getting me killed a lot. So um, thank you guys for watching this video. And like like I said before, if you guys haven't checked out the Mobilytics app, I would go download it. It's very, very helpful. It's better than a lot of the other websites and apps out there. I won't mention any names. 
So thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next.